Baron in this sort of situation to get the TPs out and aim back by pushing through the mid lane. They get the TP immediately into the root, into the stun, into the death! How's he gonna do this one? The ghost forward looking to lock him up. The E already landed. The leap forward should be fought clean. Fobs, you see they're waiting. They lock him down. Now Slot now stepping forward. And Kira's just gonna try to delete the wave and then hold on. G2 looking to up the pace this game, looking to get aggressive here. Are they gonna commit for the dive? Targumus on the way and Slot's getting aggressive anyway. That's gonna be him going down. Broken Blade ignited, but he will not fall. Triumph coming through for the heal. And now the knockup goes in as well. Kira locked into the tower again. It looks like another Great kill. Kira, Miracle, can he make it work? Immune now, Yanko's in trouble. Ends up being that one for one. Two for one overall in the favor of G2. The puppeteer comparison just keeps being more Rise, and more relevant here and now in trouble. This man cannot catch a break. <laughs> Leave me here Five and members was part of that kill. They're trying to take control of the mid lane, but even then, Flackage, yeah, what are you Buckley doing? Going after Buckley, you're right, what is happening This is here? very, very risky. Goes back, throws it in, but they just leap in. They're just going to kill him. Yankos is going to walk away. That was not good. Does uh, knock it away. Now the engage ticking off. They're trying to get something done. Misfits forcing a fight. It's a good call, but G2, are they too far ahead? Now Alti coming across. BTO buying a bit more time, but he's going to get burned down before the fight kicks it off. And now Broken Blade comes into the back line. Misfits had a man advantage for a brief moment, but it will not matter. Absolute slaughter. Devastation in the river. Caps. Oh, it's too late now. He's going to have to dash away. Ghost coming out. That's going to make it so hard. Here knows that he has to turn and fight. With the ghost up, he cannot outrun the opposition. He's just going to drop. Does Bye, not want to burn any major cooldowns. G2 on the bottom side. Misfits on the top. Broken Blade does have TP as well. And there is a flank. Well, no, it just got timed out as well. So it's going to be difficult for him to join around it. There he comes. Another one was placed around. And there it is. Curtain call. TP coming in. They're going to get the early alt coming out from Neon. They've isolated Broken Blade off to the side. But the dragon is what matters. Keep your eyes on that Jin Force shot. Buying a bit of space. It is going to get cut down. That's Ocean Soul. What will it cost G2 <laughs> for now? Absolutely nothing. Broken Blade makes it out. Yankos goes in. That's a big start to the fight. BTO, can he turn it back? No! There's just too much CC. They don't get to play League of Legends. Caps on a killing spree. Curtain call slowing Caps. Making it out to the side. Out of the range. Again, if you overstay, you might Flash go forwards. down. But now Targamus finding multiple members. But no, BTO finds a clutch ult. Misfits barreling forward. Their front line cannot be stopped. G2 running for the hills. Neon, the Gale Force in the absolute goal. Three members of G2 left to defend. But I don't think they stand a chance in this instance. Misfits, they're looking to put the finishing touches on this game, Drekkers. And if any team could pull a rabbit out of the hat, it might as well be Misfits oh. moving in, breaking Wait, the base. No, Damn, Damn. Here it's still standing. Can't do it. The XP is no. so He's resurrecting. Oh. And just That's like a quadra. that, it's a quadra for Flacken. Mercer will not be enough to stop them. Neon will not be enough to stop them. They're going to need everybody if they want to win this fight. G2 are barreling down. Mercer, there's just no way. It's not a rabbit out of the hat, it's a goddamn miracle. Five seconds on the others. G2 pushing in, Neon still standing. He does big damage, but they don't have to fight PvE. They PvE their way into the They're base. In the they're looking to break it. They just want to finish the game, and they're going to do it, G2! Looking to secure the scuttle grab. Yankos and Targumas looking to contest. Targumas with the double bomb. There's the stun. Cap still has flash. It uh, doesn't have flash. It already burned. And of course, Razork going to flash over the head. It's like Yankos with the Q3. He gets the knob hurt. But Razork smites the dragon. Will die in the end. Yankos might actually die just to the dragon itself. One more auto would be enough. Hillisang takes it with an assist from a helpful Wyvern in the river. Heal onto Hillisang into the flash. Into the flame chompers just shot. G2 will probably avoid it. I think Caps won't be able to because Hillisang's here with the quickness. Caps does have the flash to try and get away, doesn't use it, charmed up, but the Chrono Ship will bring him back. And Caps walks right into the midst of the fight, kills off Humanoid. Razork now on the wrong side of dodge. He's exhausted, knocked up double as the ghost as an option. Humanoid will spot out Caps. Damage coming down. Caps flashes away from the grand entrance. TP coming in now with Broken Blade looks to join the fray. G2 not there in time. Flacken getting time warp, trying to get into the fight. Let's do the time warp against this target as he continues to speed up Flacken. Get excited in the heel. There's the speed for Broken Blade to chase on Hinnasang. Razork has to flash the wall. G2 find two. Broken Blade steps forward. Wonder could look for an engage here. The battle back. Broken Blade. Used his dash to go forward, couldn't find the engage. Hillisang tries to get onto the backline, but immediately has to pop the stopwatch. What can Humanoid do? Hillisang's burst, but Humanoid needs to get in there before he gets 
destroyed. A double for Yankos G2 on the offensive. Razork on the defensive kicks them away, but they're having none of that today. They continue to chase, to chase, to chase. Wonder Force away. Caps flashing forward against this former team. Caps trying to clean up. Can't quite get the damage down. Fnatic on the Baron. Broken Blade on the flank. Yankos can get in there. It's almost gone. Explosive Castle already taken out, but Yankos dives in. Razor Glow kicks Yankos back into his team. Wonder trying to flash away. Baron already used. Fnatic now. Full on retreat. Can you get out with the Baron? Can you get out with your lives? That's the question. As the Broken Blade, the Darkened Blade slides in. Razor and Humanoid force up to the top side. Flacker gets the Chrono Shift. He doesn't need the life, but he does need the assist from Targamus. As much as Upset can get a single shut down, Flacken gets three and G2 take the fight. Two with a, an impressive win over Fnatic. <laughs> and a mediocre celebration. Oh. But we give him